This is a video clip about when doctors check how your body works whilst doing exercise. Okay, Susan, do you want to come through? This is where we'll do your exercise test. Can I just get you to give your hands a little rub with the hand gel on the way in? And then you come. Okay, in you come, Susan. We'll take you across here to our machine that we're going to use for doing your exercise test. All right. Why would I need this test? So this test is going to tell us about how your body works when it works really hard when you're exercising. Now, I have two questions that I'm going to ask you now and I'm going to ask you again at the end of exercise. So we're going to look at this scale and this is going to tell us how breathless you're feeling. So it goes from zero, which is you're not feeling breathless at all, and it goes down to 10, which is the most breathless you could ever be. So right now, when you're standing still, you're not doing anything, how breathless would you say you are? Zero. Good. Uh, and this one tells us how hard you're working. So it goes from zero, which is you're not working hard at all because you're at rest. It goes down to ten, which is you're working as hard as you possibly can and you cannot go for a second longer. So how hard would you say you're working just now? Um, at rest. Good. So you need to put a mask on over your nose and your mouth so you can measure all the air that goes in and out. Now, during the test, because you've got the mask on, you can't talk properly. So what we're going to do is use hand signals so you can tell me if you're okay. So I'm going to ask you questions you can answer with a nod of the head or thumbs up for yes, or shake of the head or thumbs down for no. Alright, if you really have to tell me something, you can, but use hand signals whenever we can. Now when you get to the point where you really cannot do any more, I want you to stick your hand up in the air like that. Don't stop pedalling. Stick your hand up. We'll hit the button on here that makes it nice and easy to pedal again. Okay Susan, so what we'll do is we'll take you through next door now for you to get your electrodes onto your chest and get you wired up. And then you'll come back through and we'll put everything else on. Okay Susan, do you want to come in? So we've got your, your stickies on your chest now, we've got your wired up and we'll get everything else attached too. Okay, so if you want to come round and stand at this side of the bike for me. Alright. So that just fastens around it. And what it'll do is it'll just tighten up every few minutes. That's going to tell us what your blood pressure is, so it tells us about the blood inside. Tighten that round there. Now, could I get you just to stand with your feet just on the black bits either side just now? That's it. Okie dokie. So we're going to put this on your ear. So you can see what your oxygen levels do. Alright, and then we'll attach them to these wires. Alright, and that's going to tell us how your heart's working through the test. So this is going to sit on over the top. Okay. Just going to pop this on over your nose. And to hold that mask on, we're going to use this head strap here. Is this mouthpiece here will sit into the front of the mask like that. Okay. Now, can I get you to slide yourself up onto that seat? There we go. And we'll get your feet strapped in nice and tight. And we'll get you sitting still for the first few minutes doing absolutely nothing. Alright, and that's just so, can, so we can see what it's like normally, how fast your heart's going and things like that. So this number here tells you how many times you've turned the pedals in a minute, okay? And what we want to do is keep that number as close as we can to 65. So I'm going to get you to start pedaling, okay? Just gradually build your way up to 65. So that's the pace we want all the way through. Okay, so just nice and steady like that. Not too fast, not too slow. Okay, and we'll do that for like five minutes. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is go into the exercise phase. So you just keep pedaling like that. It's gonna get harder and harder to turn those pedals. That's, it. that's perfect, just stay in that rhythm. Keep it nice and steady. Good, keep pushing. Well done. That's it, can you push that speed above 70 now, do you think? Keep those legs turning, keep them turning, keep them turning, keep them turning. That's it, almost there now. That's it, keep pushing. Brilliant. 
legs getting tired now. Yeah, you're doing really, really well. Just keep those going, keep them going, keep them going, keep them going, keep them going. Brilliant, well done, we're almost there. That's it, keep going, can you push it up to 70 again? Keep going, keep going, keep going. One last push, almost at the top of the hill now. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. One last little bit. That's it, keep, the, keep that going for as long as you can and then just stick that hand up in the air. All right, well done, right. So that's, keep them turning now. All right, I made it nice and easy to pedal again. Now, can you point to a number and tell me how breathless you're feeling now? Just keep your legs turning. We just need to keep them going just to get everything back to normal. So just keep those legs going, keep them going. And that's it. How hard would you say you were working at the end of that? Those legs turning all the time, 10. Feeling okay? Yeah? You did brilliantly. So what we need to do is we're going to slow our legs down, but we just need to keep them turning now for a few minutes just to let everything get back to normal. Is that hard work? Is it good fun? Yeah. Good. Okay, Susan, so how do you feel now? I feel great but hot. That shows me you worked hard. So all that's left to do now is we just need to take the electrodes off, okay, and then that'll be you free to go home. And what we'll do is we'll look at the results of your exercise test along with the results from your breathing tests earlier on and we'll get the results back to mum and dad. Okay, you got any more questions you need to, anything you need to know for your film? No, thank you for showing me all these tests. You're very welcome.